Another way that React controls the component tree is with keys. Now, you've probably seen these with lists. If you don't include the key, React's going to print a warning. And that's because if you create a whole bunch of components of the same type and then they change, React needs to know identity. So if I've got those 10 to-do list items and I, I don't know, delete one to-do list item in the middle and add two more at the end, like, did I, did I add and remove? Did I move them around? Did I just change the contents? So it needs to know which of these is which so it can preserve the ones that actually need to stay alive and delete the ones that should have gone away. Keys are really instructions to React. In fact, you can never have props.key because React will actually strip that off every time. So keys should really be, ideally, unique values coming directly from the data itself. Never, ever use random numbers generated while rendering as keys because those will always be different until React to destroy that data and recreate it. 